Good morning. We are going to do a kayak paddle today. Uh, it is Easter morning, uh, April 4th, 2021. Um, we're going to paddle uh, the 17-foot uh, sea kayak. It's a wilderness systems, uh, Cape Horn 17. We're going to paddle from uh, uh, Vanceboro, North Carolina, to New Bern. Swift Creek runs from uh, uh, north of Vanceboro uh, into the Noose River. Okay, so we're going to uh, launch near, uh, well, it's right there at Highway 43 in Vanceboro. Uh, Leah is with me. Um, she's going to pick me up. Uh, in about five hours or so after launching, she's going to pick me up at Glen Burnie Park in New Bern. Uh, today's paddle is going to be about 16, 16 and a half miles. It should be about just about five hours or so. Uh, we had a frost warning last night, so it's cold this morning. Uh, but the high is supposed to be about 70 degrees a little, a little after uh, early afternoon. Um, the winds will be out of the west at 10. Uh, so it should be a great day for a paddle. leaving Vanceboro now. Just put in just a minute ago. As I said, uh, should be about five hours, maybe a little bit less, depending on uh, how many stops we make. Shaping up to be a beautiful day. It's a little bit cool this morning. As I said, there was a frost warning last night, so uh, but it's warming up quicker. Quickly, so it's a beautiful creek. It's already a lot wider than I had anticipated. All right, so we're underway, and we will get back with you. In a few here. So, catch in a few minutes. Pine tree still green. I mean, blocking the whole getting the move here. Two miles, exactly 30 minutes. So, it's a beautiful day. Just thought I'd give you a shout out. It's like the current's about a half to maybe three quarters of a knot. Um, looking at it and looking at the uh, speed here. So, uh, but it's a beautiful day. Just thought I'd. Uh, Give you a, a two-mile shout-out here. I'll spin you around and let you 
let you have a look at where we're headed here. So it's beautiful and it is warming up fast. I'm getting ready to shed a layer here. So, well, I got you. See that cypress tree right there. But you see these. Uh, Roots coming up, brace roots from the cypress. Those are called knees, just like on your leg. Cypress knee, cypress knees is, is what that is. So, uh, there's millions and millions of them down here. Somebody asked me that the other day. Cypress root. Their knees, cypress knees. So. I've been disturbing these ducks for two miles now. I'll get up, fly down a couple hundred yards, land, scare them up, and they'll fly down another 200 yards. I've been up for a couple of miles now. Wood duck. Okay, so we will, uh, we'll holler back at you, holler back at you shortly. All right, we are uh, 4.2 miles, exactly an hour, we've averaged 4.2 miles an hour here. Making good time. Not in any rush though. But it's uh, beautiful. Beautiful out here. Um, I'll spin you around. I'll let you get a look at it. A little bit of breeze trying to kick up. Of course, it's opening up a little bit too. Okay, there's an old beaver hut. It's an old one. Probably six to ten years old. It's an old one. They can build some stuff that will last, let me tell you. Big cypress tree. I wonder how many raccoons have lived in that. If you look real closely below it, you can see how the uh, tree is worn down where Whatever's living in it has, has worn the bark off of it. Duck box someone has put up. Pretty one. A nice cypress tree. Thought I'd give you a six mile update here. Update you every couple of miles. This is the 
uh, Highway 43 bridge. Near the warehouse or plant, if you're familiar with New Bern. West Craven County. Green trestle in front of us there. Right at eight miles. A little over two hours into it. You can smell the pine. Pine from the uh, warehouser plant. Okay, so we're right at 9 miles, 8.95 miles. To the left here is Little Swift Creek. So we've kind of got a, a fork here. Uh, but what we want to do is we're, uh, we're staying on, on Swift Creek. So right here at the uh, 9 mile mark or thereabouts, you want to uh, stay to the right. There's a landing up here. I think we're going to stay if it doesn't look busy. Stop and get out and stretch your legs. I haven't been out of the boat yet. Highway 43 bridge back there at about 6.2 miles from the uh, from our launch point. Um, is a, a takeout, put in takeout spot and Cool Springs Landing at about the 11, 11 or so mile mark. There's another put in takeout spot. So if you decide you want to do this paddle, you don't have to do 16 miles at, all at one time. Do it up in three sections. I think it's like a 6.4 mile section from Vanceboro to the Highway 43 bridge, and then from the Highway 43 bridge to uh, Cool Springs Landing is, I don't know, five, five and a half miles or so. I'm not sure I'll uh, verify all this in the notes below. And then from there, you've got uh, the North Carolina Wildlife Ramp in Bridgeton, which is, I don't know, five miles or so, I don't know, five, six miles, five miles. Or, that's on the left side of the Noose River, heading south. Or, you could uh, take out on the right side at Glen Burnie Park, which is what we're going to do. I've never been to Glen Burnie Park, which is the reason I wanted to take you out there. So, um, but we're just about six miles from, from the takeout. Here's Cool Springs, Cool Springs Landing. It's at the ten and a half mile mark. Let's get out and stretch our legs. Here. There's no place to no place to camp and there's no facilities, there's no head, no bathroom. I have to find you a tree. Which is easy enough to do. Alright. Get on with it. Here we go. We are out of here. Cool Springs Landing. Let's get the 
get that sweatshirt off. One of them anyway. All right. Back in. Great day for her. Alright, so we're almost 11 miles, closing in on the Noose River. When we get to the Noose River, I'll uh, call it back at you. Okay, so we're exiting Swift Creek and entering the Noose River. We enter the Noose River at 12 miles. We're exactly 12 miles right here. Not happy with me. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Big water moccasin. And this little bush right here. If you can see him or not. There he goes. <laughs> We're about uh, 15, a little over 15 and a half miles, 4 hours and 15 minutes. The wind in our back, riding the current. We're in Bernie Park dead ahead. You made it on. <laughs> Yeah. We're, out, we're out of here. Here is the launch area, Green Burning Park. Nice boat ramp. There you go, Green Burning Park. 